Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Melis Yee. And I'm Ida McGill. Today is Thursday, April 21st, and we're here with your morning announcements. Just a reminder that state testing continues today and tomorrow. Attention seniors, if you had Ms. Betancourt as a health teacher freshman year, please stop by Library 3 to pick up your time capsule during Advil this week or during late lunch. The time capsules will be in boxes in the entry hall of Library 3. Are you wondering if you have a library fine or what to do with your AP textbooks? Are you a senior and wondering what to do with your Chromebook? Well, you're in luck because all that information is posted online on the library website. Today is the opening night of Wolfpack Performing Arts production of Cinderella at 7 p.m. as well as on the 22nd and 23rd and the 29th. On April 30th, there will be the shows at 2 p.m. and 7 p.m. Tickets cost $10. Scan the QR code to sh shown to pick up purchase tickets. CO's Community Club is hosting a food drive until May 16th. Drop off any canned or non-perishable food items to the culinary classroom for a chance to earn a CO ticket. Five students who donate the most items will also earn a Dutch Bros drink. Now let's pass it on over to Dylan and Josiah for our sports update. <laughs> What's crack -a in Wolfpack? I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Josiah Edwards. Welcome back to your sports update. In school sports news, our men's volleyball team had their senior night against Pleasant Grove. Sadly, they lost 3-0. Our softball team lost 11-1 against Sheldon, but tomorrow they play at Pleasant Grove, so go get them, ladies. Our baseball team lost, to, lost their game to Sheldon 12-6, but we'll have a chance at redemption today playing them again. Good luck, boys. Well, hey, we had a track meet yesterday, and boy, did we show up. Andrew Bishop and Nico McCauley got third and fourth in the varsity 100 meters with some blazing times. Christian Okuosa got first in the frost off 100 meter and Jordan Agbetter and Miles McFarland finished with fourth and fifth. Andrew Bishop and Alejandro Muhammad got first and second in the 200 meters. Andrew Bishop was eating yesterday. Great mm -hmm. job. Mm -hmm. Christian Okoa and Jeremiah Argy and Jackson Trahan got first, second, and third in the 200. Geez, y'all was cleaning out. Jeremiah Archie and Jackson Trainum also got first and third in the 400. Great job, gentlemen. Matthew McDonald got third in the mile with a time of 429. That is crazy, Dylan. What are they feeding these kids? I have no clue. Miles McFarland got first in 110 meter hurdles with a time of 1583. And we swept the 300 meter hurdles with Miles McFarland, Mason McFarland, and Jordan Agbetter, getting first, second, and third. And we got first in the 4x1 for varsity and for our soft. Franklin could never. <laughs> Joseph Garcia got third in shot foot as well as third in discus. And my boy right here, Josiah Edwards, <laughs> getting first in discus with a personal record of 145 feet. That's what I'm talking about. All right, thank you. Congrats to Anaya Bishop and Brianna Williams on getting first, sec uh, first and second in the 100 meter. Kimmy Hartman got second in shot put. Great job. And Kaylee Tisdale and Zora got fourth and fifth in discus. Great job to our fantastic team. Well, well, fact, thanks for tuning in to your sports update. Back to the anchors. Thanks, guys. Attention AP students. Are you taking an AP test this year and looking for ways to study? Well, you're in luck because the library has AP study books. Just be sure to bring your physical student ID card to check them out. The Sacramento Public Library has digital study guides as well as test banks to be used as well. Just Google Sacramento Public Library AP test and log in once you are prompted to do so. Forgot your library card number? Just live chat or call the Sacramento Public Library for help. There are also digital study guides on the reading apps Hoopla and Libby. For more information, stop by the library. Good luck on your AP test. Juniors and seniors, are you interested in earning a salary for on-the-job training as well as as a California apprentice? Or for your future college, are you or for your future career, are you planning to earn a one-year certificate, a doctorate, a four-year degree, or community college transfer to a local or distant college? Come and explore your future jobs and careers. You never know. You may even meet your future employer. Come see the possibilities at the Spring 2022 Career and College Fair on April 28th from 6.30 to 8 p.m. at Valley High School. Take a picture of the screen to get the registration link. 
Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolf Pack. I'm Ina McGill. And I'm Noah Seed. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National High Five Day, Day Wolf Packs. Packs.